Hi guys, welcome back to our course on NumPy. In our previous lecture, we covered random permutations and today I'm going to teach you how to install Anaconda, get started with the Jupyter Notebook and how to install Seaborn and Matplotlib libraries. So let's get started. So I'm sharing my screen. I'm going to Safari. So you can go to your browser and you can search Anaconda. So it's showing the name of website as I had already installed. So you can see the first search result as the name of the website. Now this is the website or the official website for installing the Anaconda package. So this is the website and you can click the download since I'm using a Mac. So I'll install it for Mac. If you are using some different operating system, it will show you the package corresponding to that particular operating system. Now it's downloading. So it's of around 620 MB for Mac OS users. It may vary according to whatever operating system you are using. Since I have already installed, I'm canceling the download, but you need to complete the download. So there's one other method to download Anaconda. If you are using a Mac OS and you have homebrew support. So go to homebrew and search Anaconda. So you will get a command to install Anaconda. So just copy it, open your terminal. So I'm going to open my terminal and just paste the command and hit enter. So paste the command and hit enter. Now it's taking a little bit time here. So running view auto update. So it has updated and it's showing cask anaconda is already installed because I have already installed anaconda. So it's already installed. Now let's move on to installation of libraries that are Seaborn and Matplotlib. You can install these libraries using pip installer package or Anaconda. So here I'll be installing them using pip installer package first. So I need to write pip install Seaborn to install Seaborn. So it shows requirement already satisfied because it's already installed in my system. Now, similarly for matplotlib, I have to write pip install matplotlib. So it will show requirement already satisfied again because I have already satisfied these libraries. Now let's see how to install them using Anaconda. So if you want to use Anaconda for installing these libraries. So you need to write the command conda install seaborn and the process will take some time. So there is some background process going on. So there will be some processing. So it shows done. So it's asking for a permission to install new packages since I have already installed. So I won't be proceeding with this, but 
since you are installing it for the first time you have to proceed with y so you need to proceed with y and similarly you need to install matplotlib using the command conda install matplotlib so the process is similar you just need to replace seaborn with matplotlib so the command will be conda install matplotlib Let me clear the screen. Now let's open the Anaconda Navigator. So open the Anaconda Navigator and close the terminal. So I've opened the Anaconda Navigator and it's showing a lot of options, but we have to select the notebook and click launch. So it will take a minute or 30 seconds and it will open in your browser. Don't worry, this process is offline. It doesn't require internet connection. So just create a new folder wherever you want to store your code so i've created a new untitled folder for that so i'll just open this folder by clicking on it so it shows the notebook list is empty and i'm going to create a new notebook now now this is a cell so in this cell i'm going to import numpy as np I'm also going to import Seaborn as SNS and import matplotlib.pyplot as PLT. And I'm going to hit shift and enter to run this cell. So it gave me no error. So we have successfully imported these libraries. You can also rename the notebook by clicking on the name that is untitled. So I'm changing it to my first notebook. So now there is an assignment for you. So assignment is that you need to practice some of the problems that we already discussed in the previous lectures in Jupyter Notebook. Because if you practice more, you'll get acquainted with this quickly. So practice some of the codes we have discussed in previous lectures in Jupyter Notebook. So in today's lecture, I demonstrated how to install Anaconda and also how to install Seaborn and Matplotlib libraries using pip installer package as well as Anaconda. We also created our first Jupyter notebook. That will be all for today. This video is brought to you by Programming Knowledge. Please like, comment, share, subscribe and hit the bell button for updates and stay tuned with us for next lecture. Thank you.